Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new. My name is Caitlin and this is Eat, Shop, Run, Repeat. In today's video, I will be talking about my experience with the Wegovy shortage on the 1.7 milligram dose. If you saw the short that I posted a couple days ago, you will know that my doctor recently bumped me up to the 1.7 milligram dose of Wegovy and I am hitting my first roadblock with the Wegovy shortages. I posted a video a few weeks ago with some of my tips and tricks for finding your Wegovy dosage in stock based on what's been helpful to other folks who have experienced this. But this is actually my first time having this experience myself. My doctor met with me last week. We decided to continue with the normal titration schedule and move me up to the 1.7 milligram dose after this week's shot. So earlier this week, she called in that 1.7 milligram prescription for me. I normally get it filled at Walgreens and within a few hours, Walgreens called me and told me that it was out of stock and on back order and they weren't able to even see when I would be able to get it. They said it would be at least a week, but it could be longer. So knowing that and knowing that I need to take my shot in about a week, I started going through what my options were. My first call was actually to Express Scripts. They are the mail order pharmacy that my insurance company uses if you do mail order prescriptions. I generally prefer to pick up my Wigovi in person, but I had heard from other folks that they've had luck getting it via Express Scripts before. So they were my first call. The representative that I spoke with was really nice. She told me as far as she can tell, they have it in stock. It's not on back order. Once they got the prescription in, they could get it to me in about a week or so, but they need specific authorization from my doctor to fill it via mail order. I guess it's a separate process. Even if you have a prescription, they have to get an okay from your doctor that they can fill that specific prescription via mail. So she basically gave me a couple options. She said, you can go ahead and initiate that process. We'll send the request to your doctor, try and get it approved and get it mailed to you in about a week or so. And in the meantime, if you want to start calling around other local brick and mortar pharmacies to see if any of them have it in stock, you can, and you can just have it switched back to a local retail pharmacy if they've got it in stock and you'll be able to get it there sooner. So I decided to go ahead and hedge my bets, do both options. I sent a message to my doctor on the portal and let her know, hey, Express Scripts is probably going to be reaching out. I wasn't able to get my Wigovi locally, so I'm trying to get it via mail order and they need authorization for the mail order. But in the meantime, I'm going to be calling around to some other places nearby to see if I can find it. So my next call was to CVS. I called one location. They did not have it in stock, but they said, hey, there's this other location not that far from you. And it looks like they have a few boxes. So I gave that location a call. It's actually really close to my work. And lo and behold, they have multiple boxes, but she warned me that it's been in very high demand and that it is first come first serve. Whoever comes to pick up their prescription will get the boxes that they have on hand. So I am just waiting right now to get the confirmation that they have transferred the prescription over from Walgreens and then it's all ready to go. And as soon as I get that text message, I am going to hop in my car and go straight there to pick it up. Because if there's any possibility of me getting my hands on it today, I do not want to risk uh, losing out on that opportunity. So I will take you along with me and we'll see if we can get our hands on it today and hopefully not interrupt my normal dosing schedule. I will make a little bit more of an update when I get home, but I got it. That was actually not nearly as hard as I thought it was going to be, just a little bit stressful. So uh, when I get home, I will update you on how things went. So I just realized that I never actually wrapped up <laughs> my video yesterday about picking up my prescription, but essentially 
I called around, found a CVS location that had the medication in stock in the 1.7 milligram dosage. I talked to the pharmacist and she said that it was first come first serve, but that she would get my prescription transferred over and get that started for me. So I got my butt over to the pharmacy ASAP and luckily I was able to grab it. It actually wasn't ready yet when I got there, but they were able to get it for me within about 10 minutes. So live to fight another day or another month at least on this medication. My doctor set my next follow-up for actually a week earlier than I need it to be so that hopefully I can get my prescription called in a little bit earlier this time. Though in the past I've had issues with insurance and getting them to pay for it if it's not exactly 28 days after my last fill. So we will see how that goes. Maybe it will be different because of the shortage issues and I might be able to get an exception, but um, hopefully I won't have the same issue with the 2.4 milligram dose if I do end up going up to that next month. So if you stuck around this long, thank you so much. Please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel if you'd like to see more content about Wegovi and my weight loss and fitness progress. And click the bell so that you get notified of all my future videos. Thanks. Bye.